you know how uh, Jeff Wilson got hurt, right? Um, they need to replace yeah. 10 touchdowns. That that might be yeah. hard. Uh, and there's a couple of um, good running backs in the free agency market. Um, who do you think? Um, do you think if do you think they should pick someone up? Um, I can give you three people that like I think. Um, I have a name, but but give me three people and uh, tell me, and I'll I'll look them up and, and see what see. Le'Veon Bell is one. Yeah, Todd Gurley and Gurley two and Gore. Gore. I'm gonna I'm gonna say no on Gore. He's 38 years old. I think he's I think he's done. Le'Veon yeah. Bell. Let's look at Le'Veon Bell. Last year he he carried the ball 82 times. Average four yards of carry, scored two touchdowns. The year before, he carried the ball 245 times, averaged 3.2 yards per carry, three touchdowns. Man, he really hasn't been good since he was 25 in 2017. He carried the ball 321 times that year, scored nine touchdowns. Was a hell of a receiver. Man, he used to catch. See, that's the thing about Le'Veon Bell. I feel like his value is as a receiver, as a runner. He used to have that patience thing, but I think he's just kind of slow now. Yeah. Look. The reason I want to say Todd Gurley, I know Todd Gurley's washed up. I know he's washed up. He's got that knee injury. But Todd Gurley is also 26, and he scored nine touchdowns last year, 12 touchdowns the year before that. Hold on, no, 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 no. Let me get full touchdown. I'm talking about rushing touchdowns, Com- uh, total touchdowns, nine in 2020, 14 in 2019, 21 in 2018, t- 19 in 2017. So it seems like he could at least be a goal line back, right? Yeah. Yeah, he but like, back? but yeah, like injury issues at the same time, and well, also like you probably wouldn't does. be able to get. I wouldn't him give like, him a lot. I yeah, they probably have to give him guaranteed money. Yeah, but yeah. you're talking about replacing ten touchdowns. I mean, that's he scores touchdowns. Yeah, and then so. um, I had one more question. I know yeah. how you think that um, how like um, Jimmy Garoppolo is going to start the season and he's going to get hurt and then Lance will take over. Um, yeah. what would be the worst game? For Lance to start in his first career mm. start, worst game for him to start in. Oh boy! All right, let me look at the let me look at the schedule. I mean, dang. what do you think off the top of your head? You got any? You got any candidates? Um, I was thinking maybe a uh, week three against the Packers. Yeah, that's that a, that was the one that came to mind too. That's a tough one. Yeah, it's a game you're probably it, gonna lose. Yeah. I, don't, I think and, Jordan Love yeah. might be good too, even if Aaron Rodgers isn't there. He's out of year to sit. Now, I, I I will say though, Kaepernick's debut I think was on Monday Night Football, and it was legendary. So yeah. maybe if he's ready, maybe there's no wrong time. I don't know. Maybe maybe having him beat a good team on on uh, prime time would cement his status as you know the yeah, quarterback the here. The yeah, pretty much. His, yeah. yeah. That's interesting. Maybe there's no – I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe there's no wrong answer there. And then real quick no. before I go, if I see yeah. you at a Niners game, can I get an autograph? Dude, my autograph is worth nothing, but yeah, sure. I'll take a I picture with you. I don't know. You're I feel weird getting an autograph, man. Are you kidding? But sure, whatever. Okay, I'll get yeah. it. I got you. All right. All right, man. Thank you. See you. Take care, man.